Hello out there. Hi, everybody. How are you? I hope everybody is doing tremendous. I hope you're doing amazing. I hope you're doing excellent. Um, I just wanted to stop in and I just wanted to say hello um, and just, just, just kind of let everybody know that, you know, I'm not MIA. You know, things are still being looking up and, you know, I'm just really taking it one day at a time. Although a girl cannot wait to, you know, take the crutches and whatever else and throw it to the side and just, you know, get back on track. But every day is a good day. So every day is moving one step ahead uh, forward. So um, I'm just really excited, you know, I'm a little anxious, but guess what? You know, I'm taking my time, y'all. I'm taking my time. So um, I wanted to talk about a couple of things. One of the things primarily why I'm here is to say I do miss you guys very much. <laughs> and I also wanted to send a special shout out um, to those who have personally called me. I thank you so much. Um, um, it meant a lot. It meant a whole lot. You know, I was speaking with one of my friends. She called and she said something very grand. She stated that there's really no one to check on the strong people. And you know what? I love her for that. Thank you so much. Um, I just, I appreciate you for that. I really do, for stopping and taking the time. Um, also, I just wanted to talk about um, how important it is for me to stress my uh, campaign. So, yes, guys, I have been writing. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. I'm working on two books. Um, and one of them is going to be a very helpful guide. Uh, the other, I believe you're going to really enjoy. I don't want to spoil it. But um, I may be sharing the book cover with you for one of my books very soon. Um, so yeah, a girl just ain't laying here healing, okay? <laughs> I'm taking my time, but I'm also planning and working in the background. So hopefully when I'm able to get up, when I'm able to um, have the, how can I put this? Because right now, I know a lot of people say, yeah, but you could be doing X, Y, and Z. Well, it's not that easy when you have home health. It's almost like having company every day, every day. You know, sometimes it could be around the clock. You know, when the weekends come, I feel so good because I have time to myself. You know, I can focus on my writing. But guys, guess what? Um, I'm just looking for some amazing things to happen. I'm talking about outside the box. You know what I mean? Outside the box. And just going full throttle. So um, I absolutely am excited, but I got off track, y'all. I got off track. I wanted to talk about my campaign. I know you guys see me sharing it. I know you see me talking about it. I am just really involved. And um, I've decided to become my own community ambassador for thyroid and also for degenerative bone disease. Um, guys, listen, I, there's a lot of things that you might not wanna talk about. You might not wanna take time to read, but it's imperative um, that you take the time to know your body, get to know, you know, get, get to know, get, get to know the conversations that you're supposed to be having with your doctor. And the only way you can do that is if you are empowered by being in the know, okay? And so I'm trying to provide that for you. I'm trying to provide you to be in the know so that you will know what conversations you should be having with your doctor. Or, um, and I know there's a lot of people out there who practice holistic and you know, da da da, whatever the case might be, you still need to be sure that you know your body um, you read up on some things and that doesn't necessarily mean that's your symptom. That's not what I'm, I'm saying here. And I'm not counting anybody out with what you believe and how you believe, you know, the way you would do things or, you know, the things that you practice. That's, that's, that's not my reason here. I'm here because I'd like to share my experience and perhaps someone may know a loved one or a family member who may be um, having some or the same um, symptoms or maybe just wanting to know, period, you know, um, I try to provide that. So I love writing books about it. I love doing speaking engagements to anyone who will listen. Um, a lot of people say, well, tell me about this. Tell me about that. Listen, guys, I just got to give it to you. Send them to www 
www.jdnmbooks.com. If you send them to the website and tell them to click on the ABN tab or the thyroid tab, there is a plethora and a wealth of information there. Also, there's printable brochures. So guys, the AVN campaign page is pretty new. Again, this AVN does not raise money, honey. It raises my voice and it raises awareness. It raises me to want to talk to people, to want to share the information so that they can share the information. Um, it raises me to try to recruit, you know, team members. And all I ask, if you're interested in becoming a team member, is that you would send them to the website and tell them to read. That's it. That's it. You know, so um, there is, there's so much information. There's so many things to cover. And once again, I can't stress this enough. I am coming into the know that it's not just adults, that de degenerative bone disease and also thyroid is no longer just attacking adults. We're talking about babies children i mean who's if you if you don't want to know for yourself know for the kids know for the children just be empowered whatever you do and being in the know um i can't wait to share a lot of the stories that i have um and how you face your challenges how you get through your challenges. Um, and I'm doing it one page at a time, <laughs> one testimony at a time, one journey at a time. So um, staying positive and having a positive circle of support is a major, that's a big plus y'all. That is a huge plus. You know, people think I could do it on my own. Can I be, I'm guilty because I was one of them. You know, honestly, if there was no support through this process, can you imagine you always having the ability? You know, that's almost like you're having the ability to see and your sight gets taken away. You have the ability to walk and then you're losing a limb or you, well, you, you can still walk because there's prostheses, but you know what I'm saying. If you came into this world with everything and then and, and things that you do are habitual and you have the freedom to use how you choose, run, jump, walk, skip, talk, see, hear. I'm talking about these things that we're all blessed with. And then you don't know how or what might happen one day that it's just out in a second. Some of us, it gets us permanently and other of us, it gets us temporarily. However it does, can you just imagine? So what do you do? What do you do when the crises hit? What do you do when life happens? Let's talk about that. Because a lot of times what we may not know earlier might hit us later on, but not, not even that, not even that. Some things might just come because it's age or over time. Come on, let's just keep it real. Okay. You know, um, the key is how do you do better from that point? How do you move forward? How do you keep a smile on your face? It's okay. If you don't feel good today and you don't want to be bothered, guess what? That's where the beauty comes in. I ain't with it today. <laughs> you know, don't be scared. I ain't with it today. You know, um, so how, how was I getting through this or how am I getting through this? You know, I could have laid and just wasted away. I could have said, you know what? I'm just not doing absolutely nothing, 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 nothing. But in my downtime, I got a chance to rejuvenate and I'm, I still am, I still am. I'm reflecting, I'm rejuvenating. I'm going over things in my mind to settle as far as having peace, continued serenity, you know? So that my mind, body, soul, and spirit can line up with each other and continue to do the awesome works whatever my purpose is here for. I do go through a lot. A lot of people say, gosh, every time we turn around, every other year or every year, there's another surgery or something else happened. You darn right. This ain't new. I've been going through things since I was 14 years old. And for those of you who read my first novel in the tell-all, and everybody called me the cat with nine lives, and everyone that knows me, they could tell you, yeah, yeah. 
this girl has had it. When I tell you that this is nothing compared to those things that I came through, I'm telling you, I'm, I'm telling you, you know, things happen, you know, um, I'm, I'm not looking for things to happen every year, but it do do, you know, but there's one way to this, to six, to, uh, becoming successful in this. And that is never close your eyes and die. What do I mean by that? I'm not speaking of close your eyes, boom. That's not what I'm talking about. If you close your eyes and die, what I'm saying is you simply given up. You simply shut down. You know, you simply said enough. You simply let go of the rope. This is what I'm talking about. But when you open your eyes and you say, you know what? I'm alive and I'm holding on. Just that alone just that alone can be that uh, gasp of breath that you have to continue on. I hope I'm encouraging somebody today. I hope I am. There's a lot that I want to talk about, and I've already been on here now for 11 minutes and 25 seconds too long. But I am going to say this because I've been skipping over what I've mainly been on here to talk about. But I am gonna say this. There have been many a days that you guys might have heard me on the radio. Gosh, I can't wait. Oh yeah, honey. I cannot wait to return to radio. Um, there have been many times that I have been um, online and there have been many times, you know, where I wasn't feeling well at all. You know, I was totally, um, submerged by the thyroid, you know, by, but I, I kept it moving. I kept it moving. Can I still talk? Yep. That's why I'm ready. Oh, how you doing? Um, you know, can I still use my hands? Yes. That's why I still write, you know, can I lend an encouraging ear or an encouraging word? Sure I can. So those things that I can do are those positive thoughts that I hold on to. See what I mean? But through me continuing on and not allowing, oh my God, my face doesn't look right. You know, oh my God, you could see, you know, the Hashi's disease. It's my face. I look, I look, you know, oh my God, I look. Come on. Come on, honey. Hashi's don't make me. Okay. All right, Queen ain't gonna let you take the mirror. So, <laughs> let me stop y'all. Okay, so anyway, guys, it was, I just wanted to get on here to say no matter what, you know, I said a lot, but no matter what, you know, I just want someone to be encouraged today. And I want to challenge you to hold on, hold out. Don't close your eyes and die. Don't. Don't. There's so many things and so many things that are happening to each and every last one of us around the world. And we don't know what state of mind or what situation or what issue may have hit people, you know, around the world. We don't know what they're dealing with at this second. I'm talking to you guys, but I don't know what you're dealing with at this second. I don't know where you are right now, you know? I don't know everybody's state of mind, but what I can do is just reach out and tell you, I love you. <laughs> Be free. Oh yeah. See, I ain't even paying attention to my shirt. Be free. Be free. Be free in being free to care for yourself. Be free to love yourself. Be selfish to be free. That's what you do for you. Do something for you, okay? You're beautiful. You are strong. You are loved, you are thought about. I don't have to know people. I don't have to know who's watching this and who's not. But you are an amazing person. And you are needed and you are wanted. 
And do you know why? Because I sweat so. <laughs> That's why. So, it's been 15 minutes, guys. I've got to get off of here. You guys got a lot of other things to do. But I do implore you, please, guys, please, you know, take care and just know that you are thought of and you're loved. And don't forget to visit the website. Share the wealth, guys. Like, you know, sign up for the email, all right? It's www.jdnmbooks.com. You know, we're going to, we're doing newsletters. We're doing newsletters and there's going to be some other fantastic stuff and opportunities. So, you know, for everyone who's out there, who is, um, you know, willing to share what they're doing in their community and for their community. Okay. So I love you all so very much. And thank you for giving me, um, I'm going to say it 16 minutes of your time and my time is up. I love you guys. Bye.